Hey, how you guys doing? Uh, so today we're going with uh, Henry McKenna, uh, who was an Irish immigrant, the immigrant that came to Kentucky in uh, 1837, uh, decided to uh, make bourbon. Um, it's pretty, uh, or Kentucky whiskey, I guess, what, is, what would we call them? No, bourbon, it is bourbon, yeah. So decided to make bourbon. Um, so let's try it out. Um, this one is going to have a huge shout out to one of my best friends, uh, Alan Ward. Thank you so much uh, for this bottle and your friendship. We have been through a lot, my friend. So same thing. We always go with the sniffer for the first taste. You saw I just opened it. Brand new bottle. Let's see where the cap goes. There we go. Okay. McKenna. All right. As you can see, it's uh, amber gold in color. Ooh. The first, it's the first smell I get. I definitely smell the alcohol. So it um, gives me a little concern, but that's all right. Never judge a book by its color. As I smell more, I get a little bit of uh, vanilla and oak with a slight hint of uh, caramel. Mm -hmm. Oh, man. Do not judge a book by its cover. It is, this is a very smooth drink. This is a very smooth drink. Um, there is no taste of the burning alcohol sensation. This is honey and cinnamon and some dark fruits man this is this is this is a delicious drink this is uh really good yeah definitely so you, you, you the smell throws you off a little bit uh but the flavor is awesome so you get the honey you get the cinnamon you get some dark fruit in there uh and the finish is long it's rich and it doesn't overtake uh your palate so uh, maybe a slow burn at the end for some people. Um, I didn't get too much of it. It's very good drink. So, Henry McKenna, 10-year-old bourbon. Uh, highly recommend it. Check it out. Uh, once again, but I also recommend pretty much almost every whiskey. Uh, so, I hope you guys are having a great one. Um, shout, once again, shout out to my best friend, Alan. Alan one of my best friends, Alan Ward. And um, uh, today's drink is to the, the Georgia Supreme Court for... Constantly changing the bar exam that's coming up. So thank you for that stress uh, and uh, giving me a reason to have some more bourbon. Have a good one.